What is this? From diesel or gas pacers to rocket powered racers. Nomads, go mats, RV schoolies. Don't turn it, tweak it, tune it, fix it so smoothly. That's why he's badge. Everybody needs one. Okay, welcome back, sports fans. This is going to be a rare, 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 rare opportunity because I'm not going to do one of these again. I just thought that I get so many questions on it that I'll do one. What I'm going to do is show you the generator before I touch it until we get it running. Now, these two generators I got from my daughter in Two Hills, Jennifer, and these, this one she thinks has been sitting outside for three to four years. This one she has no idea about. Now, for the normal person, would it be worth it? I don't know. We'll find out when we get into it. But remember, I haven't changed on carburetors yet. So we'll see. This one here is 120. This one's got 240 on it. So I'm kind of... But what I'm going to do with these, I have no idea. I'll probably just give them back to them. So what I'm going to do is set up the camera up in the shop somewhere and you can just watch us work on it and I'll show you what I do and I I'll use the same program that I use for every generator when I get it and I get it running I'll show you the same thing now just on a side note here is a a lawnmower that, that Teresa from Alberta School is giving and she felt so bad to give me this thing because it was really rough shape but, you know, I sort of got it running really good. So, it's a really good lawnmower now. I don't know if she wants it back or not, but it's a really good lawnmower. Uh, so, I might even keep this one. I don't know. It's pretty good. I got it running. It took me about an hour, an hour and a half, but it was pretty bad. But I got it running. It runs just fine. And it re So, that's what we're going to do. I'm going to set the camera up and we'll take this. We'll do one. I don't know which one I'll do yet. Probably this blue one. Because it the switch it doesn't work, none of it does work. So we'll get this all I'll show you exactly what I do from point to point. And that's what I do to every one of them. Every generator I get, I do the same program. So you'll see exactly what I do. This one I sort of blew it off with air, which I usually don't do. But I blew this off because I have the compressor at home. So anyway, that's where we're gonna go with this. So um I'll set the camera up and we'll get out of it. Whoa, 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 stop, stop the presses, stop the presses. We got a problem here, Bobby. Now, I was telling you, you were just watching a video on that generator. Well, that generator is a piece of garbage. So we're going to junk it because if you go, I had 78 minutes of video. And I'm just not going to torture you guys that much. And what it is is that... Uh, it's not charging and the carburetor. I couldn't get it to work at all. It's still seized up So I took the carburetor off the red one put it on that one and it ran just fine, but It's got too many issues. So we got the red one going in About 15 minutes. I put a new spark plug in it change the oil um, Put the carburetor clean the carburetor up and this is what we ended up with this. So I'm just going to cut the video short. I know you wanted to watch the whole pain. And it's just a pain. So I'll leave it at that. I'm sorry, but I'm not going to put you people through 78 minutes of me fighting with the carburetor. So I'll leave that with you and I hope you get something out of it. And we'll see you in the next video. Badge. Everybody needs and one. And we love our badge. And, and remember, remember, he's, he's not, not asking. asking.